Hi there, Norman with iSaveTractors.com. Today I'm going to be showing you how to set the point gap on your Kohler K engine. Before I begin this tutorial, I'd like to just briefly explain what the role of the points is on your Kohler K engine. The points is controlled by a plunger, which is right here, that rides on the camshaft in your engine. When the camshaft reaches a certain point in its rotation, it pushes this plunger out causing the points to momentarily open. When the points open, it induces a very high voltage in the secondary windings of your ignition coil, which causes a high voltage spark to go across your spark plug, thus creating your engine's combustion. So as you can see, the points play a vital role in the proper operation of your engine. Now today's demonstration will be performed on this Kohler K301 12 horsepower engine. This came out of a John Deere garden tractor. Now the points are located right down here next to the camshaft cover. There's normally a points cover covering this, but I've removed it for this demonstration. And the primary tools we're going to use to do this is a set of feeler gauges, particularly one that is 20 thousandths of an inch thick or 0 .020. We will also be using a flathead screwdriver to make the adjustments. Now to set the gap in your points, you want to first turn the crankshaft until the points open to its widest setting. And when you're done with that, you take a flathead screwdriver and you undo this screw right here. Your next step is to take your feeler gauge, make sure it's the feeler gauge for 20 thousandths of an inch, which would read 0 .020. You're going to put the, po the feeler gauge in between the points, like this, and then you're going to take your screwdriver and tighten down this screw. and then you remove the feeler gauge. And after you do this, you want to confirm by putting your feeler gauge in between the points. Now, if you did it correctly, there should be just a slight drag on the feeler gauges. With that slight drag, that means you have correctly set it to 0 .020 or 20 thousandths of an inch. Now, as I mentioned earlier, the points play a vital role in your engine's ignition system. I recommend checking the condition of the points every year. You'll notice that there might be a slight gray metallic dust-like material that builds up in the points over time. I recommend cleaning these off if you see that. The way to clean the points on your engine is just to open the points up so there's a gap. Take a piece of paper, put it in between the points, close the gap by turning the crankshaft, and then gently pulling the paper out. Just repeat that a few times, and that will help clean off your points contacts. Now, if your points where where the cleaning doesn't help with your ignition system, I recommend replacing the entire point system and setting the gap properly to 20 thousandths of an inch. And there you have it. That's all it takes to set the gap setting on your points for your Kohler K engine. Please subscribe to our channel for more awesome videos on Kohler K engines as well as vintage garden tractors. Also check out our website at isavetractors.com. We sell every part to restore your Kohler K engine as well as most of your vintage garden tractors. Thank you for saving the tractors.